April 3rd. If thou hadst known, if thou hadst known in this thy day the things which belong unto thy peace, but now they are hid from thine eyes. Luke 19.42 Jesus had entered into Jerusalem Jesus had entered into Jerusalem in triumph. The city was stirred to its foundations, but a strange God was there, the pride of Phariseeism, which was religious but a whited sepulchre. What is it that blinds me in this my day? Have I, a strange God, not a disgusting monster, but a disposition that rules me? More than once God has brought me face to face with a strange God, and I thought I should have to yield, but I did not do it. I got through the crisis by the skin of my teeth, and I find myself in the possession of the strange God still. I am blind to the things that belong to my peace. It is an appalling thing that we can be in the place where the Spirit of God should be getting at us unhinderedly, and yet increase our condemnation in God's sight. If thou hadst known, God goes direct to the heart, with the tears of Jesus behind. These words imply culpable responsibility. God holds us responsible for what we do not see. Now they are hid from thine eyes, because the disposition has never been yielded. The unfathomable sadness of the might have been. God never opens doors that have been closed. He opens other doors, but he reminds us that there are doors which have shut. Doors which need never have been shut. Imaginations which need never have been sullied. Never be afraid when God brings back the past. Let memory have its way. It is a minister of God with its rebuke and chastisement and sorrow. God will turn the might-have-been into a wonderful culture for the future.